2025 isn't just turning out to be the year of AI, it is the year AI became a full-fledged consumer obsession. From apps that talk, draw and plan your life to companies like Microsoft printing billions of the back of cloud and compute, we are witnessing a full-stack AI gold rush unfold in real time. Today, we are breaking down two news reports that show just how fast this space is growing. According to a report by Sensatar, generative AI apps were downloaded 1.7 billion times in the first half of 2025 alone. This number is up from 1 billion in the first half of 2024. What about in-app spending? It has doubled to nearly $1.9 billion. And that's not just people trying ChatGPT and logging off. Users spent over 15.6 billion hours across 426 billion sessions, which is almost double in the previous half. Asia led in downloads with 42.6% market share driven primarily by India and China. Latin America saw the highest in-app purchase growth, but it was North America that still holds the monetization crown. It comes as no surprise that ChatGPT was the clear winner at the highest revenue in every country except China. People, according to Sensatar, use it more days per month than Reddit or even X. If you're wondering what's the average daily usage of ChatGPT, then it's nearly 16 minutes, which quite impressively is nearly neck and neck with search engines like Google. More so, according to the Sensatar data, weekend usage on ChatGPT is up which clearly means that it is turning out to be more than a work tool. Users are also leaning on AI for lifestyle help, from budgeting to meal prep to wellness. More than a third of ChatGPT prompts are now lifestyle related. Now let's talk about who's genuinely cashing in and we are focusing on Microsoft. Microsoft today reported its quarterly results and had $76.4 billion in quarterly revenue which is up 18%. No surprise, it's the AI and cloud which are doing the heavy lifting for Microsoft. Microsoft's Azure revenue was up 34% and Microsoft Cloud hit $46.7 billion in revenue, which saw 27% year-on-year jump. CEO Satya Nadella didn't mince words and was quite categorical. And I quote him when he said, cloud and AI are the driving force of transformation. Azure for Microsoft alone brought in over $75 billion this year. Let that sink in. $75 billion from cloud, which is now being driven by artificial intelligence. Microsoft's profits also surged. Net income was $27.2 billion, which was up 24%, while its operating income climbed to $34.3 billion. Now, what's pushing this? According to Microsoft, it's enterprise AI adoption, co-pilots across Microsoft products and infrastructure powering the same gen AI apps that we just spoke about. While consumer AI is growing fastest, enterprise AI is already minting a lot of money for Microsoft. So here's the story. Gen AI apps are exploding in popularity. Users are engaging more deeply and the companies that build the infrastructure like Microsoft in this case, are laughing all the way to the bank. AI isn't just a bubble, it's now becoming the new normal. Keep an eye on how this plays out, especially with Meta, Apple, Google, and almost every other tech company who are racing to scale. It clearly seems like when it comes to artificial intelligence, we are just getting started.